on the Late Late Show. She also happens to be the leading lady in America's number one film, The Scorpion King. You have lost your power. Throw it all away. My magic. I see your fate, Hollow King. Please welcome the lovely Kelly Ho. I saw you backstage, you were covered for a moment. I was, it was freezing. Oh. I think you keep it cold like that backstage on purpose. No, no, no. <laughs> Congratulations on The Scorpion King. Thank you. You must be getting mobbed. Are people mobbing you? Number one film, this is an exciting time for you. Not yet. No? <laughs> Why not? Why, why aren't people mobbing me? Yeah. I don't know. I really? mean, should they be? Yeah. Do you get any, are you getting more attention or not? Um, yeah, I mean, I, I certainly uh, get to talk to a lot more producers. Yeah. That helps, that helps, yeah, right? Yeah, it does. How long ago did you film this? Because it was ages ago, wasn't it? Yeah, it was like a year ago. And, um, and it's, it's, it's really weird to do publicity for a film that, you know, you did so long ago. Because everybody wants to know, like, all the funny stuff that happened on the right. set and stuff. And, and you can't remember. You can't remember. Right. Yeah. Now, there was a reason. You, didn't they film two at a time? Is that why? They filmed, didn't they film two movies? Tell me if I'm right here. No. no? The You're mummy? wrong. Okay. You're not right. What was the movie before that The Rock was in? Oh, Mummy Returns. They filmed, yeah, but, but I, I that, thought they filmed that, and I and then they filmed yours right after that. No, no, That's what no, I no. Heard. They I think I'm right. I think no. I'm right. You think no. you're right? No. <laughs> okay. And then, then they let the Mummy Returns go out, and they let the Scorpion King go out. Yeah, that's how it worked. Anyways. Okay. Um, so you don't remember anything about the filming? Was it wasn't it difficult? It was really it was it was really hot. I remember that. Okay, that's and a remember, start. That's yeah. a start. You can remember that. Because we, we filmed it in like the summertime and we were in the desert and it was like... Well, that's going to be hot then. Summertime and desert, that's going to be hot. Yeah? It was like, it was like 110 degrees. Whoa! Out. Yeah, it was sweltering. That's over 100 degrees. <laughs> being silly. Almost. Um, now... Oh! Speaking of caliente... Do you enjoy doing this kind of stuff, the maximum thing? Do, I seem to be half naked a lot lately. Do you have a favorite picture? <laughs> and what you know what? I actually did have a favorite picture, but it didn't make it in there. Which one was it? We had to recreate it. this photo for us. <laughs> we were we, we had to do it in the at the end of the day because they had this really great idea where they were they, they had this is all white, you know, I'm wearing all white, mm -hmm. what what I am wearing. Right. And um and, and they had they, they brought like a white cat onto the set, but I'm actually allergic to cats. Mm -hmm. So we had to wait till the very end of the of the day to shoot it. And I'm holding this cat and apparently like the cat's litter box is in the cage with it. Mm -hmm. And it like it messed and then it stepped all over its poo. <laughs> and so it had like poo on its paws. Yeah. On its little cat paws. Yeah. And so the woman who was, you know, like taking care of the cat, she she took, you know, like one of those white wipey thingies, um, yeah. those wet naps, and she wiped it down, but it didn't dry. So the cat had like now brown, wet looking paws yeah. and it's like sitting there in the maxim shoot and I'm like holding this cat with these like poopy paws. That's that's your favorite picture? It would have been it would have been my favorite picture had it the poopy paws it. not I don't want to hear about that. <laughs> I want to that's just what's your That's the real maxim though. There you see that's I don't see any poo there. That's <laughs> You, it's in the corner behind the bureau. It's always fun to hear what women might call it, you know. I, I haven't heard poo in a long time. Poo. Uh, we, we've had you on before. We've never actually talked about your last name, uh, which is uh, spelled H-U uh -huh. and pronounced who, Kelly who. Right. Uh, and did, when you're in grade school, did they just go crazy with it, the kids having fun with that? Well, I went to school in Hawaii, and, you know, I mean, a lot of people in Hawaii have unusual names. We pronounce it Hawaii, by the way. <laughs> 
No, I like it sexy. I like it. Okay. Now, I just kidding. Hi. Hi. No, I, just, I like it when it comes out That's like that. Because you're the howling man. I know. I don't, <laughs> I don't know this stuff. But anyway, so so I went to I went to school with um, with you know people with, with of all ethnicities and mm -hmm. um, and I, I had people in my class named like Cindy Wen and Erito Watt. Wait, wait. So Cindy? Kelly Hu was not unusual. Cindy what? What was her name? Cindy Cindy Wen. And then and Erito Watt. Oh. Yeah. There's your comedy bit right there. You just take that on the road. So it's not it's a big... It's like a roll call in Hawaii. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you go back to Hawaii a lot? All the time. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. That's where your family is, right? Yeah, all my family. Uh, and I, I know that uh, we had you on once. You, I know you're heavily into spam. We don't have to go into that again. It shocked me. <laughs> but you, you want to write a cookbook, possibly? Well, not, not necessarily about spam. I'm, I'm, I hope I'm not. working on a cookbook. Right. right. And, um, and it's actually about like healthy eating and stuff, because I have a restaurant now where you know, oh. I have like healthy eating and all this kind of healthy like soup, salads, and sandwiches. Where's that? Um, it's in Beverly Hills. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, on, Thanks on, for on Beverly inviting Drive, me. Basic Bite. <laughs> okay. Come, come, come. Right. We'll give you a sandwich for free. Great. Anyway. I'm there. <laughs> sandwich. <laughs> okay, keep going. Hawaii, and my, my aunt overhears that I'm, I'm, I'm doing this cookbook, and she's like, oh, I got the perfect recipe for you. She goes, you know, you take one can Spam, and you slice them up, and then you pour one can apricot juice on top, and you put them in the oven, 365 degrees, ter for 30 minutes, and you cook them just like that. Yeah. Serve them, oh no, you know. And she I said, oh no, you know. What is that? Oh, delicious. No, you, oh, delicious? Yeah. <laughs> spam and apricot. That's, you know what I'm thinking? Yeah. I'm thinking poo. That's yeah. what I'm thinking. <laughs> Sadly, that's what I'm thinking. That's bad. It might as well be, right? Oh, yeah. all right, we're out of time. Uh, the Scorpion wow. King, number one film in America, the big star Kelly Hu. Big hand for her. Right back. Oh man, isn't Kelly the greatest? I can't wait to hit the pool with her tonight. <laughs> Unfortunately, the naked thing's not going to happen. I guess Fabs will wear my robe again. He did look great in it. And I picked up a bathing suit for Kelly, and she's going to love it. I'm not going to go to Craig's. He told me he got me a bathing suit, a one-piece. I mean, it sounded nice, but it wasn't a one-piece. It was the bottom half of a bikini. I said, I thought you got me a one-piece. He said, it is. But, John... Nice row. <laughs>